you want to start a fire, it's essential to go on lower ground. So you see we're on top over there. So I'm feeling right where that stump is would be the perfect fire starter. See, not a leaves, not a dead leaves. Some through the trail it looks like. We just start our fire right here. What you don't want to do, pick out the dead leaves and um, have yourself a foundation. Do a sort of foundation right here. Get the supplies that you have. So we have here, it's always essential to bring a box of matches to the wild. Um, I don't know if you'll exactly be lost with them, but in my case I have them. So I'm showing you how it would be if you did get lost with a bunch of box of matches. 250 matches right here. Start that out, that would be our flint if you will. We use some of the toilet paper that we brought you know, to start the fire, to ignite the flame if you will. Fire needs to catch onto something. So we just got a couple of rolls of this, a couple of sheets. Put it right down the floor. But we can't, I just want to use a pencil. Great, great conductor of heat. I mean, let me tell you this. If you are lost in the wild, be sure to have a broken pencil. So we put that right in the middle. Now we have some sort of uh, test tubes. This would be our, um, to save our fire. Take the fire that you have, put it in here, save it for later. I have here a trusty Swiss army knife and we're gonna cut it in half so we can use, so we can use it. Now, you wanna cut in a somewhat of a circular motion. Fire starters right here. It's not going to get tight, it's not going to get harmed. You're going to want to cut off the, deo, the deodorant part. It's high in nutrients, high in protein, kind of like coconut if you think about it. So I'm going to put it in my pocket for later. The residue right here, we're going to use to put in our fire. Scrape out the residue and it should be fine. We're going to use the box to start the, the fire. You want to blow in it gently, nice and warm. Now it dies pretty fast. So you only have several seconds of warmth. If unable to sustain the fire, hypothermia may set in. Keeping this fire alive is crucial. Well, it's not really working. I'm pretty sure it's the wind or something. Plastic bag, very useful for making fire. Now, strike the match, set the bag on fire. <laughs> Maybe put the deodorant stick in there. A little bit of this granola bar. Let's try one more time. There we go, that's our fire. It's perfect. It will save us for the night. 